himself, Jukon. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds. Not too many seats to be had in this arena. They ring the bell, and here we go. Oh, and that left hook hurt him. The courage on display here is incredible. Those counter punches have to hurt. So much hype surrounding this big matchup as the hype continues to build for this showdown. Situations like this, Todd, will either make or break a fighter because the expectation from the fans of the people here, of the millions of people around the world, people like you and I sat here expecting everything and anything can break a man or make a man. This fight has a real good flow to it. A very competitive round here so far. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. Not a lot of punch out, but thought there might be more action here. Missing with that jab. Swing and a miss with that hook. Gotta let your hands go a little bit. It's okay to very close round with 10 seconds to go. about Zhu Khan in that last round. As bad as boxing judging can be. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Last round, complete domination. Let's see what we have in store for us here. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. When you're training to fight a swarmer, you got to focus on your conditioning because they will push you to the edge of your limits. You are fighting a swarmer. Be smart. Be sharp. Concentrate what you've got to be confident. Do not dance his dance because that swarmer, once you do that, you're giving a man a chance that shouldn't have one. Nice counter shot. Big hook. Good thing it didn't land. When are we going to see a jab from these two? Halfway through the round, and man, these two are going at it. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. fighter focuses on that outside game you don't see them get hit too often you don't see them in trouble a lot but that's what their mantra is outside fights create so much unpredictable movement move left to right box forward box backwards you don't know if they're going to attack or defend nightmare fighters just when you thought we'd see a lull in the action here we go again This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Let's talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. After what we saw in that last round, it's pretty obvious who has the advantage here. I seriously hope the judges kept their eye on. And there's the bell to start the round. After a really strong round, let's see if they can finish the job. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down.
They both want the knockout. One punch could change everything in this battle. The hand speed in these lighter divisions is always so impressive, but if you can sneak in a power shot every once in a while and sit down on a punch, that's where you separate yourself. Fighters landing in these exchanges. Judge is going to have a tough job. Nope, that hook won't score. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now, this fight will say, you know what? I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Parries that jab away. That left hook misses. Beautiful counter shot. Walk away from each other and then run right back into trouble. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. Let's talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. I promise you, all three judges here are going to give that round to you know who. They ring the bell, and here we go. They've got all the momentum on their side after that last round. Let's see what they do here. Todd, my motto is if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hand down. Here we go with these two lightning quick lightweights. It's the one who draws first blood Todd. That's what you've got to look at. If you hit and you know you're in there with a banger, you've got to be on it, but you've got to be confident. You couldn't write a script like this. This is like Rocky versus Apollo. And that hook misses. Every time he throws a punch, a receipt is coming right back. Some real good back and forth between these two fighters. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. Throws the jab, but doesn't score. What do you think of this fight so far, Johnny? What you've got to do, Tony, is anticipation. You've got to wait. You've got to, you just got to throw caution to the wind and just hope you're never going to know where the shots are coming from. you just got to put in a guess. Catch and shoot. You can tell who's stronger and who's faster. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Let's talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. Well, it's no secret who has the advantage after that last round. But... And there's the bell to start the round. Coming off that fantastic last round, let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. By the way, the connect percentages have to be off the charts. <clears throat> I think it's safe to say one of these fighters certainly has a significant speed advantage. You can tell who it is. Let me explain to you about a fast fight, a fast fight that's got hand speed and footwork. They're relaxed, they're confident, they know they just have to quick burst, boom! In a split second, they've let four shots go. Their footwork has got them out of the way. And these guys are so relaxed, and that's why they can maintain this all the way through a fight. Can they figure out the combination to this safe? 
skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. <laughs> One punch could change anything when these two step in the ring. Needs to put some combination work together. One punch is good, two punch is better. Tried to score with a jab. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there would be uh, some more action here. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Let's talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. Talk about a one-sided three minutes. We just saw it. I seriously hope the judges kept their eye on this fight. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. Well, Johnny, has anything surprised you here as we enter the final frames of this bout? That power, that power might be the do or die. That power might be the, the, the equalizer. Beautiful counter punch. And he misses with that jab. Misses with the straight left. Exchange punches. We're at the halfway point of this round, and both of these fighters have had their moments. Still could go either way. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other, because no one dare do anything out of turn. Both men step back for just a moment. They call it the chin. How strong is your chin? Do you have a glass chin? These are things that can affect the fight. Don't get trigger happy, because all of a sudden you're gonna be gassing yourself out trying to get that shot, and that's when they catch you. We wanted action, and they are del This round could go either way, 10 seconds to go. Talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. Well, there was no doubt about who won that round. As long as they don't get complacent, you think this is too easy. It's... We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. That last round was huge for him, Johnny. How does he keep the momentum going? Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. Nice counter shot. Missing with the hook. That counter punch caught him clean. Well, Johnny, you know, in the lightweight division, they've got fast hands, so get ready to see some lightning. I've seen certain fighters that can depend on just their power alone. Forget tactics. They know the second they touch you, it's done. That's where the confidence comes from. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Both of these fighters have had their moments. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Both of these men showing exceptional chins, by the way. <laughs> Caution being thrown to the wind.
about that time counter shot? Misses with the straight left. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Catch and shoot. Has to be careful for that receipt. It's always... Let's talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. That was almost a 10-8 round. Com and there's the bell to start the round. That round was complete domination. Let's see if we can shake things up here in this round. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. Don't let this fighter's speed fool you. There's some method to the madness. These are precision shots, and they're coming at lightning speed. This can be so frustrating when you remember such a fast fighter. Fast fighter that can throw three, four shot combinations before you've even let one off. That creates frustration, and that's when it gets hard. And he misses with that jab. Nice counter shot. Pretty close fight here in this round. When someone punches that hard, you don't want to trade shots. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. There's been a significant aggression difference in this fight, Johnny. What do you see? How do you deal with an aggressive fighter? What you do is you fight, fire, we fight. You either give it them back because that's where they're comfortable, or you play calm, play cool. You'd like to see more jabs. That counter shot lands. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. Let's talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. I promise you, all three judges here are going to give that round to you know who. You can't leave it up to the. They ring the bell, and here we go. Johnny, can he keep the momentum going after that last huge round for him? Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. These two were made for each other. the charge action from both of these fighters. Well done with that counter shot. Yukon, the monster, in trouble. Just one punch away from turning his fortunes around. Defense, defense, defense is everything because they got shot once. They know they can get caught again. So for now, just defense. Work on defense. Blocking and stopping the shooting. And they figure out the combination to this shape. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what? I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Well, Johnny, we're a couple rounds in. What are you seeing so far? Sometimes when you get in there with someone that's so powerful, you start thinking. You've just got to be smarter than them. You've got to be like a little baby and a big bucket. These punches coming from every angle. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. He is down big time on the scores. The bell sometimes. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. That 
was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. And that's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet, not until your senses have come back. They're both going for the KO. It's so obvious. As we enter the final frames of this bout, Johnny, what have we seen so far? When you have a fight that's got that great footwork and that great hand speed, it's so hard. It's an uphill battle. Which one of these athletes is going to say, I can't take it anymore? I can't believe we're only halfway through the round. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. It's all offense all the time. Blistering hand speed from both of these outstanding lightweights. This could be really intimidating, Todd. If you know somebody's got the punch power, someone's got the speed, it can be intimidating. Just depends on how confident you are as a fighter. Nice slip to avoid the jab. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. Talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. Pretty dominant round there. Let's see how they respond here in the next round. Dominance without a doubt. And there's the bell to start the round. Coming off that great round, let's see if they can build on momentum here. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. A jab for these two. Well, Johnny, we're in the early stages here. What have you seen so far? Because you've got a good chin doesn't mean you've got leather skin. It means you can still get caught. So you've got to go for those pointed areas over the eyebrow, the cheekbone. You've just got to try and cut them skimming. Go for speed. Olachenko is buzzed. Here's the onslaught is over, at least for now. What recovery skills they are. What a shot it was. Completely gone. I thought there's no way he's going to finish this round. But look at that. Look at the movement. Look at the speed. Back on it. Like it never happened. We're at the halfway point, and both of these fighters know the round is still up for grabs. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Just like a match made in heaven. Ukon <laughs> goes down. Wow, let's take another look at that. I need to... So we enter the final 10 seconds here in a pretty dominant display. Let's talk about Zhu Khan in that last round. It's not over till it's over, but that knockdown is going to be huge. You've been put down. You've got to think right. So far. They ring the bell, and here we go. They really got banged up last round. What can they do here to change the momentum? That knockdown we just saw was a heavy knockdown. I'd be very, very surprised if he'll come out fresh as a daisy. That's not going to happen. He's got to hustle now. He's got to, he's got to bluff him. is off the charts. Might want to think of holding on here for a minute. Uh. 
You can see the heavy breathing, but that's not slowing him down. So far, it seems like aggression has been the key. This fighter just not slowing down. Sometimes when you have a fight, the best way to beat a fight is not give them what they want. Because they want to get you there. They want you to stand there toe-to-toe -to -toe with them and have a tail. That's what they do in the gym every single day of the week. What you've got to do is you've got to frustrate them as they set their shots. Get out of the way. And they'll get so angry, so frustrated because they can't work. What a round so far as we've reached the halfway point. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. What heart, what desire, but at what cost? They have no respect for each other. Monster, dazed. Get your legs back. It, a unanimous decision win. This is the last thing we expected. What a fight. What a style. What a pace to get a unanimous decision. That is mad. This, I didn't see that coming. I thought this would be tight. This is nowhere near tight.